Captain speaking. Attention, attention. Finish your coffee, extinguish your cigarettes, buckle up and hold your heads. We are going to kick some ass. Hello guys, I'm Sadamon the Bears, welcome back. This is X4 Foundation's Split Vendetta. Let's play episode number 8. I got some bad news and some good news. The bad news is I found a mission for 8 million of credits in this system and I was like, what? Alright, I need to record a video with uh, that mission. But before I could get my stuff ready for recording, the mission disappeared. So guys, bear with me. I will try to record something else, alright? So if you do, or if you did do a mission for, I don't know, 5 billion credits or more, please let me know in the comments, because I was really, really excited when I saw a mission about building a station in a system for 8 millions of credits. So, see you later. I just remembered right now that I need to show you something, guys. Most of you who are my YouTube subscribers, you know, guys, that I'm colorblind. So, I decided to install a mod which makes these crystals much more visible for me. Like, uh, the, the biggest issue for me was uh, when I saw a bandanite or the other crystal one should be blue and the other one should be like a purple i never knew which one is the blue one and which one is the purple one i was like all right but now i do have a mod for it which makes it much much better for me and i know when i can when i see a crystal which is white at least i think it is white I know it is stupid bandanite, but I will mine it anyway, so this is it guys, alright? So this should be a bandanite, we will see in few seconds, let's take a look. So it's bandanite for 1000 credits, which is uh, not much, but when you are mining crystals you will get, I don't know, 150, maybe 200 bandanite crystals and then it's money, right? So guys, uh, I was thinking about to make a short video about my uh, most favorite mods for this game and if you want that video or if you want to see that video, please let me know because I would like to share my experience with these mods because these mods which I am using make this game so much better. And uh, before I will leave the system and I will try to take care about my space stations, I have to mention one more time, the music in X4, it is so good guys, it is amazing, like, I don't know any other game which I could fly the spaceship just straight and doing nothing, just listening to the music, but X4 Foundation Split Vendetta is one of them. A few days ago I was uh, doing some shopping and I was thinking like oh, right maybe I will download the music from like the soundtrack Split Vendetta into my phone so I did and I went to do some shopping for I can't remember what it was but the point is I was in a shop I had the headphones and I was listening to a Split Vendetta soundtrack and uh, somebody was saying something to me and I was like, what? What is he trying to say? And uh, some guy was uh, just uh, asking me about some price, like old guy, he couldn't read the price tag. And I looked on that price tag and I, and I am saying like, oh, it is only 186 credits. Star I started to laugh because I was like, what did I say? What credits? The price is not in credits, only of course that old guy just was looking at me and like he was probably thinking like what the hell is this guy smoking and I was like you know 
it is just a funny story like I, I would say when you spend uh, 100 hours in a game in a week and the game is so good as x4 foundations you know that you will do something stupid like uh, you will say or you will tell the price uh, in a shop to somebody in credits not in real currency captain speaking attention attention finish your coffee extinguish your cigarettes buckle up and hold your heads we are going to kick some ass So guys, uh, Captain is speaking from his uh, cockpit, maybe the voice is a little bit distorted, maybe, and we are approaching to fight, and we are getting first hits, I guess. So basically, I was very, very lucky to find this destroyer in this position, and when I approached it, I was like, oh, I have to help these guys, because basically... They will, right, right, you will get your backup, right now. So, when I saw this bad destroyer, I was like, this is my chance, I have to do it, I have to try, because uh, these, these guys, <laughs> these guys are very hard to kill, and I do have only three ships, which are, I would say, fight ready, and, uh, I do have three stars captains in, in my other ships which are attacking with me and what I am missing in this game it is some kind of a fast commands for your wingman or for your fleet let's say uh, attack, defend, retreat like a, I would say keyboard shortcuts I was thinking about to install a voice attack for this game, but it won't help, I guess. But the point is, I was very lucky and we did kill these destroyers. So, hopefully you are not falling asleep while I am talking during this video. So, enjoy the footage and this is my first kill of a destroyer of course i wasn't alone so i am not the hero but we did our best and uh, i didn't lose any ships i was really really surprised like of course i think that the other guys they did lost uh, some ships but survived that's achievement for me guys a big one So, Captain, over and out. End of the transmission. Thank you very much for watching. I will see you in the next one. This is the way.